Well, it's about quarter to one. And I'm still at the Best Western. I stayed for two nights. I want to take a picture of this enormous Tesla charging station. You know, in the Build Back Better Act, there is all this money being spent on subsidizing the electric car industry by taxpayers paying for electric charging stations. I think that should be done privately. Uh, the government didn't, well, they subsidized the oil industry, but not in the actual uh, construction of a nationwide system of uh, fueling stations. So I don't think it's the government's business here. And two, nobody seems to be asking two pertinent questions. Where's all the lithium going to come from? And what are we going to do with the batteries? Because you can barely recycle them. And where are all these batteries uh, going to go? I don't have the answer. I'm thinking it may be uh, more some type of uh, hydrogen um, fuel cell type deal. Uh, there's a guy that I watch, uh, Downey Live, he's in Vancouver, BC, and he uh, test drove uh, for the day the Toyota with the, um, uh, with the hydrogen fuel cell. So if I find that, I'll link to it in the, uh, in the description. Anyway, um, I got up, actually the housekeeping called me at nine asking if I wanted room service, and I got up at eight, and when I was sitting eating breakfast here at the hotel, I just had to put my head down. So I went and kind of sort of lied down and relaxed and uh, uploaded the third um, uh, uh, yesterday's video and wrote my uh, wrote my brother back an email. And I think I need to get out and ride uh, a little bit. I was going to go to Parkfield and eat at the Parkfield Cafe, but they aren't open Wednesday. They're only open Thursday, a day through Sunday. So that'll have to be another day. But I'm gonna get out, I'm gonna ride around. It's a nice day. I just didn't wanna sit all day. So you hear the bike idling like a champion. I'm feeling better. It's gonna be a good day. Every day ride this. So we'll see what's next. Our next stop of the day is at Blackwell's Corners. This is at the intersection of California 33 and California 46. There's been a store gas station here for almost a hundred years. A guy named Blackwell founded it in the 1920s. This is the last spot that the 50s actor James Dean, and no, not Jimmy Dean the Pure Pork Sausage, I've used that line more than once on film, but this is the last place that James Dean the actor was seen alive prior to the car accident in Chalam, or Chalame, which is west of here, and we're gonna head out of that way now. Um, so, this is a pretty famous spot for James Dean type people. Uh, I never saw the fascination with the guy, but my God, people love him. So, there you go.
So I took a little sip, took some nausea meds, just out for a small ride today. Oh, Black Wolf's Corners in the early 80s. My brother and our riding bro and I rode down to Los Angeles for a day or two or three. And we were coming up 33 and we got gas and Taft. And I wanted to talk about this all on one trip day, but it, it didn't work out like that. Well, Charlie had a CB900 and Rich had a, had a Suzuki Katana. And I had the CX500, and I was riding a friend of ours from work, uh, Miss Vicky, who I took down to see her mom. Uh, Vicky ended up uh, being with my Hanai cousin Donnie, and they all lived together when Donnie passed. Um, I've lost track of Vicky. I hope she's uh, doing well. Uh, it's, a hard, it's a hard blow when the man you love dies right in front of you, and, and you're trying to save his life. Anyway, um, they went ahead and just sped off. And in 93 odometer miles from Taft to Koalinga, up 33, they made it in 59 minutes. At what is now a stoplight, it was a stop sign for California 33. And there was also a stop sign at California 41 and California uh, 33, and the, uh, they said they slowed for the stop sign. So I'll talk more about being in, in uh, actually in Koalinga when I get there, but we're gonna ride out to Chalam, we're gonna look at the James Dean Memorial, and then we'll put on back. So a short day today, and we'll see what's next. Our next stop of the day finds us at the James Dean Memorial Junction, which is at California 46 and California 41 in San Luis Obispo County, California. I don't know if this is exactly how the intersection was back when James Dean died, but I believe that a car pulled out of Highway 46 to turn left to go so I don't know why you double back, but somebody uh, pulled out in front of James Dean and James Dean was allegedly speeding in his Porsche 356 Speedster, which was pretty much a licensed race car at the time. Um, and, and the uh, driver of the other car and James Dean were killed. So a sign that you can barely see through the uh, through the supports here is the, the road to Parkfield, where the Parkfield Cafe is. Uh, like I said earlier in the clip, uh, or in the vlog, we're not gonna go there today, but we are gonna, uh, gonna continue on the, uh, to Chalami and take a picture of the memorial marker, and we will see what's next.
Here's the uh, marker made uh, put here by a, a Japanese businessman who just loved James Dean. James was born on February 8th of 1931. February 8th is my brother, uh, one of my brother's birthdays. And if I remember this right, it's the uh, birthday of uh, one of the greatest generals ever in, in, in the United States Army, William Tecumseh Sherman. Now Sherman was not a very good guy, and this is where history kind of gets complex, where you have a, a, a person who, who just murdered the indigenous, laid waste to the traitors of the South. So history is not ever, is rarely as neat as we'd like it to be. Anyway, the James Dean died on September 30th, 1955 at 5.59 in the afternoon. You can't really read this, the sun's right on it too, but. This uh, first one was 1977, and the second one uh, by Siida Oshini in 1983. There's my beautiful bike. God, I love riding it. You know, when I took off the, uh, I've noticed this when I, uh, I don't have it on eco mode, and it also, it also made me the motor is really starting to get broken in. My God, it, it speed, you know, you gotta really pay attention to the speed because, you know, as you saw uh, in the clip, in the, ro in the road clip, car clips in between Black Wells and here, <laughs> damn, I was in the 80s without any problem. Of course, it sucks up the gas something fierce, but I don't care. So, here's our stop in Chalam, or Chalami. We're gonna head back east. And then we're gonna take 41, and then turn north on 33, and our next stop will be probably in Avenal, where I'll get off of 33 and uh, put through town and see what's there. So, we'll see what's next.